1945, 1986, and 2011. These events shaped the way we think about nuclear power. Even though it's a clean source of energy that could actually be the solution to global warming. Wait a minute, so you're calling something that killed millions of people a savior? Let me explain. To know how clean this energy is, we need to understand how it works. So, nuclear power relies on a process that we call fission, and it's a splitting of the uranium-235 present in the uranium fuel. It happens when we fire a neutron at the uranium atom, resulting in light radioactive products between neutrons and gamma rays. During fission, some nuclear mass transforms into energy that powers fast-moving neutrons, and if some of them strike the uranium nuclei, fission results in a second larger generation of neutrons, and so on. This is what we call a chain reaction, and to understand it more, we're gonna experiment, so let me take you with me. Okay, welcome to our nuclear lab, except these fire matches will be our uranium fuel, and this is our neutrons. When we fire one neutron at one atom of the uranium fuel, look what happens. We can see that the nuclear fission goes on and on, and it gets bigger with each neutron strike. And that is exactly what makes it able to produce an enormous amount of energy. And by the way, the fire's still going on. And I don't really know how to stop it. And what's even more special about this type of energy is the absence of any source of combustion. So there is no CO2 involved, which is the main pollutant causing climate change. So it sounds like the perfect solution, right? Wrong. Unfortunately, there is a catch. Nuclear power can cause a meltdown, which is a disaster caused by the overheat of the rods containing the uranium fuel. And it leads to an explosion releasing radioactive air. So for now, we just have to wait for the future and see what it holds for us. Hey, the world is in a huge mess right now. But I have some good news. Over the last 10 years, many startups came up with new ideas concerning nuclear power. They changed nuclear plants to transatomic reactors and rods to pillows. And today, nuclear, solar, and other clean energy sources to cover. And there is no more polluting power in the world. And by that, we can definitely save our planet.